Hey guys, this is Miguel McLeod Technology again. Uh, I just wanted to do another tutorial video sh showing you guys basically what to do uh, when you're done printing your transfers and how to heat press them so that you get a more consistent look and more consistent feel. And also if you're getting a little plastic feeling um, with the DTF transfers, which sometimes happens, especially with larger transfers, how to minimize that, how to make sure the transfer here is better to the shirt and actually lasts a lot longer. So here we have a beautiful transfer here and this is supplied by our friends at GTS so make sure to to go check those guys out when you get a chance. Um, so the first thing we do is we have to make sure that the heat press is heated up to 320 to 325 degrees, right? That's the, uh, the basically the best uh, temperature settings to put for the, um, the heat press when you're pressing onto the shirts. Anything more than that, and it will be pretty much overcooking the transfers where they might come off a lot easier. And anything less, it might not adhere to the shirt properly. So the first thing that we do is we line the shirt up and then we just iron it. The reason why we iron it is because we want to get rid of the wrinkles um, just so that the transfer can adhere better to the area that we want it to go. Then, we place the transfer down. You want to line it up pretty much in the middle, so you want to like eyeball it if you don't have a uh, guide. So you just eyeball that in the center. And then you want to put Teflon sheet or parchment paper or butcher paper. The reason why you do that is to protect the transfer. If you don't, uh, there's a really high chance that the heat press is just going to melt the transfer and it's going to ruin the the design of the shirt so to make sure that that doesn't happen you put the the teflon paper and then we press this down and this is set to medium pressure and we set it for 15 seconds 15 seconds is all it takes it doesn't take a minute it doesn't take two minutes only 15 seconds right and then as soon as this is done you'll have a transfer that is ready to be peeled and that's it it's pretty much done you know you've already done most of the hard work when you're printing it so this is you know the easiest part of this whole process so as you know, this is cold peel, so we just let this uh, cool off. It comes out really, really hot, so be careful. Um, some people I've seen, they've done this thing where they get the Teflon paper and they rub it across to like dissipate the heat. Um, it's all up to you. I've even seen some people um, use ice packs, right? They use ice packs and they just, put, they just slowly put it down just to cool it down really, really fast. It's all up to you. Whatever you guys want to do is how, how, um, is how it's going to get done, really. So after that, you just want to make sure it's cool and then you start peeling it. So it's super easy. You don't have to worry about it ruining or anything like that. These are really, really uh, high quality transfers, like I said, provided by GTS. Um, another thing about these transfers is that the shelf life on them lasts a really long time. We've had customers put their transfers after they printed them and cured them, put them for like three months. Um, and that's just because, you know, we use high quality inks, we use high quality powder. Um, so make sure you go check out our consumables in the cloudtechnology.com so that you can have that same type of shelf, shelf life. Okay, so, um, I know it's kind of hard to show this on camera, but this feels a little bit plasticky. And the reason for that is because um, the powder, the, the, the actual ad adherence to the shirt, gives it a little bit of a thicker feel. So to get rid of that and to make the, the transfer thinner and feel more like the shirt, you put the Teflon paper back down, you press it again for about 5 to 10 seconds. Um, you can do another 15 seconds as well. It's up to you. And uh, basically this will make it thinner. Okay, so put this up, and then that's it. Now this feels like it's honestly part of the shirt. So if you guys want to know more, if you guys want to uh, get this transfer or any other transfer you see, uh, any, <laughs> any other transfer pretty much, <laughs> um, go to mccloudtechnology.com for the printers and for the transfers, go to GTS. <laughs>